am I so nervous? We have to show you my old yearbook pictures. The goal for the video is if it gets 10,000 likes, I'll do a makeover on Mr. Miser. You guys have already probably seen some of the clips of what's about to happen. I haven't. I'm actually pretty nervous. We're about to, you know, embark on this journey of returning to high school. Got my backpack, got everything ready. Um, we're walking around the big camera setup. I don't know how that's gonna go. Apparently our name's on a visitor list. So me, Alex, and Sophie, we're meeting Sophie there. And I'm kind of nervous. I'm getting more nervous. I don't know why I'm nervous, but I am. Cause I've met, I didn't really like high school. Uh, I don't know if I'm gonna put that part in, but high school, I was not, you know, the coolest kid. I was not the worst kid, but I'm just a normal kid in high school, so I don't know what's gonna happen. I really don't. We're gonna go see my teacher. He's probably telling everybody there's a special guest today. Shout out Mr. Miser, you're probably saying that. Maybe not, so we'll see. Um, I'm not trying to stay at school for too long. Let's go hop in the, the car. Uh, Alex gonna ride with me. Let's do it. So since I'm Sophie's personal barista, she requested an iced latte. This is from Octane Coffee. I already had my coffee today. I'm probably gonna need another one. I want one right now, so. So good, just finesse that. We're meeting her there. I'm not trying to be too hype with what I'm wearing today. I'm not trying to like show out. Just wearing plaid pants, t-shirt, and Air Jordans. Um, let's just get to the car. <laughs> I don't know, I just keep rambling because I'm kind of uncomfortable doing this, but at the same time, I'm doing it for you guys. Think to yourself why are you double parking in that last clip well i'm the only one with a reserve spot there and i asked them and they said i'm allowed to double park so that's why i do it but all right let's go this traffic's taking too long we're not even gonna be able to film much because you probably can't even hear me because my car is kind of loud but Ooh, okay guys we're skirting to school i have an idea of a thumbnail i want to get and if you guys are watching this you'll see if i got it already but I don't know if I'm gonna get kicked out for trying to do it because I wanna like park in front of the school, in front of the big part of it, and like sit on my car and take a picture. Sophie said she wants to be in it, so we'll see, but we're just gonna check in when we get by the school, and then um, we'll just pick up like the initial of me going in there and stuff. I am gonna be announcing some of the winners of the giveaways I've been doing recently. There's a couple like back to school shoe ones I've been doing. I'm gonna announce at the end of the video, so wait around for those. If you entered any of them, and we might do a giveaway in this video, you never know, because why not? Welcome to Atlanta. There's literally a hearse behind us. I don't, that's weird. And I don't know if there's a coffin in there's just two old dudes riding in it. And it's just like, why? 55 miles an hour. So we're about to pull into the school. Now, honestly, I probably shouldn't take the front entrance because it's probably blocked off for the kids trying to leave for lunch. But we're a little right on time. It's uh, nine or 10.58. We have to go check in with the front desk. They put our names in, get in. It's very, you know, strict at schools, which is good. I think that's a good thing now with, you know, things that have been going on, but I'm just getting more nervous, man. This is just, especially with the, my dad calling me, talking about that stuff, doesn't help. So we're pulling up at the school. Honestly, it's like kind of modern. Let me go this way. Bro, this is so weird. I guess I'll say it when Sophie gets here. A rule, or she told me that if she comes with us, I have to show you guys my old yearbook pictures. So. I'm gonna go. Oh, golly, man, I'm so nervous. What the heck? Why am I so nervous? Like, freaking heart is beating so fast like actually my heart is beating so fast Let's see where Sophie's at she should be here right now good question so why is Sophie coming if she is she just gonna she, she just like, wants to be here gotcha. oh there she is right there <laughs> we need actual okay we can't say that we're in high school oh, right. <laughs> I'm recording Ugh. well can you keep this in your car dang rocking the Jordans today yeah 
I couldn't decide between your merch shirt or this, but I think I look more LA in this. LA. <laughs> so Sophie told me one of the requirements of her coming is that we have to show you my old yearbook pictures. So they're in my car. Let's cut back to that real quick before we go in there. We'll show you guys my yearbook pictures because I looked a little bit different and I don't want to do this, but she said I had to if she's coming. So <laughs> let's go. This part right here is what Sophie wanted to do, not really me. So we're just going to show you really quick some of the my year, my senior photos and then maybe the year before that. So let's show them real quick. RT when you see it. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. That's all you get. This is your senior year. I literally don't even remember it looking like this. I, I, I guess I don't have one. Right there. There we are, boys. That's that's what you get. Anyone want to see pictures of me? Nope, we don't want to see that. <laughs> and we're going to now cut back to actually going to the school. So enjoy the footage. Alex decided to take a business call <laughs> as we're walking in. And uh, I just don't know how to feel about the cameras and stuff here. So I don't know if I should just wait until we get in the film. Like, I don't know. I'm just kind of nervous. <sighs> oh, no. <laughs> well, is it all done? Yes. Sophie forgot her ID, as usual. Where are we? I know, it doesn't Classic. say. Sam and Harrison? Yes. There you go. And then when you come out... Psych! Let's go, baby. Mr. Meisner. What the... That is weird. Library is different. How are you? How's it going? Yeah, hug. I got the whole crew here. Got the whole Hi. crew. Hello, how are you? Good. This is Mr. Meisner, camera. Hello. <laughs> Look at, give me a hug. Yeah, man. <laughs> well, I guess I can hug you. <laughs> this class ends at uh, 1130 and then the morning show crew comes in. Okay. How long you can stay, but I've got a girl that I need for you to meet. She's 14. She's got 25,000 subscribers for her YouTube channel. She's banking about 1600 a month. So tell me what it is that you're gonna be doing here. I don't know, there wasn't too much of a plan. I just wanted to come by, you know, I didn't know if you had a plan uh, of any sorts. I know you just have a class going on, but so I wanna kinda, I wa we did a little bit of walking around the school, just kinda talking about what, it, you know, that I went here and I, there's not, I didn't have too much to show. I don't have any, I'm not trying to go see any teachers or anything because I never really, the only teacher I really like. <laughs> Connection. Talk, yeah, exactly, I didn't I, I know the teacher, so. I don't know, other than that, not too much going on. Let me give you the nickel tour. Alex, you haven't been here since you graduated. No, I haven't, no. <laughs> All right, so right here, Student Production Awards. Right now there's 13 of these babies up there. Alex, did you get in trouble on that edit video? Yes. Uh, <laughs> no, Alex, let me show you the edit. Alex Levito. This, this hey, there right? are other guys, so. Wait, <laughs> Alex Levito, I heard all of this like commotion and bodies hitting the wall on the ground. He's got tears in his eyes. <laughs> a girl, little blonde haired girl. He's on the ground, he's in tears. There's a girl just <laughs> <laughs> And I don't know what had happened, except that she decked you. Came in, slapped my eye, and then I was like, whoa. And then you kicked and then, her. Yeah, and then we both got ISS. Yeah, the and then. Bad kid. But Okay, so I want to give you guys a little quick background. We're right now in, this is where the morning show is featured. Now there's a whole, I guess, breakdown of the whole class. I won't, you know, go too in depth, but I want to talk about, I attribute a lot of my passion for videos, of course, to this class. I honestly would say, and you know, this might not be the most traditional thing, but I attribute this class more than any other class I've taken throughout high school and some of college because it kind of started the foundation of me doing video. So I liked video. I did YouTube like with my, whatever camera I had. But when I came here, I learned, you know, how to edit, learn how to take video in the proper manner. Mr. Meisner, like I've said previously, he was a little bit strict with the process, but that's a good thing when it comes to, you know, making sure you're doing the right thing. And so I came in here, the first level one class, I decided to get into it and I like to do it. Oh, Mr. Meisner, step out. Oh, you are? You come over here? Guess I mean the class, he's saying he subscribed to the channel. What's going on, man? 
Nice to meet you. You look older than me, man. <laughs> What's your name? Amir. Amir. Yeah. Nice to meet you, man. So that's pretty cool. We got some viewers. I don't. I honestly don't know my, you know, the demographic of what age group. I know primarily it's like a good chunk of it is 18 to 24, but I would assume I have a lot of, you know, high school age. I've been doing a lot of videos recently on back to school, and they've been blowing up hundreds of thousands of views. I got like 100,000 views in one day off of one of the videos. Back to school is a huge thing, so that's why I thought I got to come back and do this, but. Got in level one, the main class, learned how to film, edit the proper way, and then with through you know all the process, Mr. Miser thought it'd be a good idea to bump me up to the third level. I think I went to the third level, right? Yep. For the morning show and start producing my own stuff. And you know, there's a whole big process and learning through sound, video, all that through that process. But I think starting that basis in a class, video production in high school was like the start of all my you know, video loving, like getting into it. Alex and I used to go and just film anything just because yep. we wanted to film and edit because it was just fun. And I think finding classes, even if they're in high school that interest you outside of maybe, you know, the regular standard classes that could, you know, help anybody with getting into classes. So I don't know if you saw anything special with me, Alex, particularly with coming into classes, but. Probably the, the big thing that I look for is work ethic. You guys had it, you had a passion. I think that's the number one thing is work ethic. If you want, the morning show crew is actually coming in. I've got to give kind of a little pep talk about like mm -hmm. what we've got to do. Let's cruise out there. So <laughs> we might be going in. Um, giving a little word to the class, but it's funny because the guy that came over, he knew Sophie, so that's how I know that he watches the videos because if you just breeze past her, maybe, but he saw Sophie's like, hey, so. This is the one class that I was not that weird in, but if I went to any other classes, I would cringe. <laughs> no. But as you can kind of see here, there's like edit bays with multiple computers, and that's just kind of the vibe. You had computers to edit on, camera equipment, all that, you had all at your needs, so that's kind of what helped. It's getting better, but now it's the worst part because it's beeping and I have to maybe say something. It's horrible. It's different. Prison sense. You know, official out here. So, a couple of things. One is we've got a former morning show, actually two former morning show people uh, visiting, uh, shooting today. First one is Harrison Neville, uh, who graduated in 2013. He's a YouTuber. Um, I subscribe to his channel. He's got roughly about 305, 307,000 subscribers, uh, mostly dealing with young men's fashion. Um, he's like, see what I'm looking for. We've already got a piece for that. This is Harrison Neville, uh, graduated in 2013. These guys here are here to shoot, I guess, a video about coming home, which is I mean, sort of, it was your home. Kind of, yeah. Just shooting a little video. I've been doing a lot of videos relating to back to school uh, that have been doing very well lately. So I thought mixing in, coming back to school, and I kind of wanted to do like a little uh, thing with Mr. Meisner, and I'm doing, I have a challenge for the video, which I haven't announced. I kind of mentioned it to you, but I kind of want to do, I do videos ranked like fashion, and I want to do like a full streetwear kind of makeover on Mr. Meisner. <laughs> and so, yes. if you guys think, I, I the goal for this video is if it gets 10,000 likes, I'll do a makeover on Mr. Meisner. And we'll, we'll knock that out. We'll put him in some hype. Yes. Stuff. We'll do we'll get Supreme Jordans. We'll put everything Mr. Meisner. So. Yeah. Everything. We're, we're going to try to hype out Mr. Meisner. And I think a lot of people want to see that, you know, high school teacher makeover. So you can do a, a short little promo piece. I need it by tomorrow at lunch. It'll go on the first morning show. Okay, let me see. And get uh, everybody to go on there and there's uh, vote for Mr. Meisner. There's 2,300 students Yes, I think, uh, right there. I think everybody would like to see you uh, oh swap God. your style. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Jordans. And, yeah. We'll see. I, I'm excited. I think we could easily do 10,000. We've done a lot more before, so it'll be a, a surprise for you. We're going to, I see it as we go to the, maybe the mall or something, and then we just kind of, you come with me and I pick out your entire outfit and then. You know, we have to reveal it on camera to everybody and just and be like a strut. Yep. You walk the runway. No, no just act yes, you know, no, act completely no, regular. You, don't, don't yeah, yeah. Yeah. you wanna shout out your Instagram, you can you know do all that. <laughs> Before you guys leave, I need to get a shot of you on the wall by your hand. So once you graduate the class, you get to put your hand on the wall. So I'm right here. He's gonna grab a picture of me looking at it, but there's my signature. Hey. 2013. That's me. Five years ago. So should I put my hand up to it? 
Uh, yep, look at me. Make sure all the shots are... Alright, okay. so we're just going to walk around and show the lunchroom real quick. We're out of Mr. Miser's class. Thanks for having us in there. We're going to walk in and show you guys a little bit around. Um, there's not much going on because it's lunch, but we'll show you how big the class is. There are 2,300 students, so pretty big, but we'll just peek in over the window. So when you graduate, you get a little banner on the wall. I did not, I hated the school I went to, the college, so I didn't even get a banner on the wall. It's kind of sad because I didn't get into the school I wanted to my grades were at. <laughs> so this is the lunch room. Um, kind of weird memories, but this is weird. Sophie, is it weird to you? I used to sit like right there. I still feel like I'm like one of the kids here because I just look so young. Like I don't feel like I've been gone for five years. We get some clips outside and head out. Um, so I just want to come by and okay. Yeah. Right here, right here, I'm and so proud of like what you're doing. Thank you. Like, appreciate that. Uh, this is so like yeah. you are an inspiration to these guys. I, I mean, I feel like I have a lot of work left to do, but you're never finished. But if you're doing good work, good quality work, and you're showing students like part of what you do, you think you're just selling fashions and building your brand. You're inspiring a generation of young filmmakers, and that's what I want you to do. I, I don't want you to ever stop because this is one phase, and then it'll be something else. And you too, Alex. I mean, like your book is an inspiration. Like you're inspiring these guys to get out and do, mm -hmm. and that it can be done. That anyone, there, yeah, that anyone can do this. So we're pretty much finished up now. It's just time to get the thumbnail and I want to do it with my car out front of the school. I uh, just thought it'd be a cool way to do it. So we had to move the car now. Sophie, will you record me turning yeah. on the car? Stay right here. Made it to the end of the video if you guys want to see some of the giveaway winners you can go ahead and stay and watch this right now i did a couple raffles the other day and i have all the winners now and you guys might have seen them on my story but i just want to show you guys exactly who won so you guys can know this is all legit so the winner of the sean witherspoon one was hunter newton congratulations to him jake salazar won the off-white blazer we had i think it's pronounced emilian one out of france for the supreme raffle and will plowman for the massive streetwear lot then there's one more we had ethan win the back to school essentials prize so those are the main ones right there for all of the raffles now i like doing the raffles because it's like they actually have a system to randomly pick and you guys know that it's not like me just picking somebody that i know i've never done that but some people think that it's rigged and it's definitely not so for raffles like that the last one was one dollar and they want all that stuff shipping that out today and then there was the back to school shoes giveaway now i'm going to go to the video right now and then pick a winner because a lot of you guys have been wondering which shoes got them all right here putting the video into the random youtube comment picker now 5111 comments we got all the comments loaded up here we're going to go ahead and randomly pick winner right there and as you can see we have the power phase because i think this is running gabriel sentio let's see if he uh follows me let's hope gabriel follows me he'll win the adidas power phase or they're not actually the power phase they're called the continentals but they're essentially the same thing and there it is he does follow me shout out gabriel congratulations i'll be reaching out to you right now now i'm gonna go ahead and wrap up the video that is going to wrap it up for the back to school video again if you guys did enjoy and you want to see me go back and do a makeover on mr meisner leave 10,000 likes down below thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed seeing me go back to school i will see you guys next time this is harrison signing out